Bonsoir les amis, this is Leanne Stanfield and uh, you can find me at parisianfrench.com Today is the third day of the 2017 and the new year resolutions are popping up like mushrooms and I want to make sure that I give you enough strategy for you to make yours happen so what do you have to do in order to start speaking French this year? So um, the first thing that you should do, you should uh, get a French language coach to help you get there, to keep you accountable and to strategize to make things happen for you your own way, meaning uh, to fit French in your life so that you don't drop it again because I'm assuming that all of you, most of you at a certain point dropped uh, the language learning sometimes it got too exhausting, sometimes it got too busy and so something's gonna give and what is gonna give? something that for you uh, qualifies as a hobby so that's going to actually go first and um, I'm sure that a lot of you have gone through this before so um, a coach will help you stay on your uh, game and uh, the second thing to do is to actually practice French every single day so if you want to speak French in five months you should practice every single day between 15 and 30 no 30 minutes, at least 30 minutes a day. So if you want to speak French this year, confidently, you should invest 30 minutes at least every single day. And remember, it's not the 30 minutes that actually is the difficult part, it's the every single day that is the difficult part. And on my Facebook, on my profile with my friends, I'm actually putting day number one, yoga, day number one, two, three, two, so that someone keeps me accountable. I also have coaches. Um, I have a coach now that I have hired for the entire year of 2017 to keep me accountable and on my game so that I don't slide as, you know, life happens this year. So if you want to speak French confidently this year, at least 30 minutes a day. If you want to maintain and see progress between 15 and 30 minutes a day, so you should do this every single day. Now, what happens if you don't actually find those 15 minutes a day minimum, right? I will challenge you, I would challenge you to find at least five minutes or three minutes, very little. And you have on this page snippets that I give, you know, um, you know little videos that I give so that I help people who don't find the time to practice longer and um, um, so that they have something and they don't miss that day of French. But the best and the best thing of all is to get the free French crash course which will give you enough material and after the crash course you get other other freebies. I shouldn't have said that because it's, a, it's supposed to be a surprise and a secret but really you do. You get more and more uh, free resources to maintain your progress depending on what at, depending on whatever level you're at so get the free French crash course go to parisianfrench.com and get it or go to the link that I gave you for the group and you're gonna find the link there and a community that is very active and um, very very um, energetic and lively and so I love it very much so that's all I had for you for today. Oh, now another hint. What do you do actually if you don't find someone to speak French to speak? Because even if you have a coach, a French language coach, uh, you would speak with that person once or twice a, uh, a week, but not every day. So what do you do in between? Well, to compensate for that, my rule of thumb is everything that you do in French, do it out loud. So when you write, say it out loud. When you read, say it out loud. When you listen at some at something, speak along, sing along on the music. When you're watching, when you're listening, say all always out loud or as much as you can. So that's all I had for you for today. 
Um, stay on your game and don't ever give up on your dream to become bilingual. Learn to speak Parisian French and break the language barrier. Merci beaucoup et à demain. Au revoir.